Welcome to the Dynasty Football Key. Like and subscribe. Today we've got breaking news. Jerry Judy has been traded from the Denver Broncos to the Cleveland Browns for a 2024 fifth and sixth round pick. So Jerry Judy, who is due to be uh, extended at some point in the near future, uh, the Denver Broncos decide to go ahead and make a trade for some draft picks, which they themselves have given up a lot of draft picks to get Russ Wilson, who they recently announced would be let go. So a lot of changes in Denver. Currently on the roster, you've got Cortland Sutton and Marvin Mims as the wide receiver one and wide receiver two. We'll see if there's some more changes to come there. With Mims having been a rookie last season, this will at least give him a temporary opportunity to step up. We'll see who else they draft in that place. Uh, you can't blame Jerry Judy for Mims not producing as a rookie. Uh, he did get some opportunities. So uh, still, he's a young player. We'll see what happens there. Um, I, I would say uh, maybe this is a opportunity just with the news and the offseason being generally quiet. Go ahead and try to make some offers to sell Marvin Mims at this spot. Maybe you can sell Jerry Judy in this spot as well. Uh, now that he's got Deshaun Watson, which would still seem to be a quarterback upgrade from where, he, you know, having no quarterback in this offseason. Uh, so maybe someone would bite there. I would still expect both teams to have some desire to try to bring in some uh, some other competition at the wide receiver position just because with the Deshaun Watson contract for the Browns, it's still very expensive. So you're going to want some really cheap rookie contracts. If they were to give Jerry Judy an extension, you know, I can't imagine it being massive uh, just due to the limited production. So we'll see what happens there. I think for Mari Cooper, his role is safe. Elijah Moore... Uh, you know, had an opportunity as wide receiver two for this team. I, I don't think it's going to happen. This kind of shows how the Browns feel about that. Uh, definitely like the player Elijah Moore, uh, but this is significant competition for him. So, not an exciting wide receiver situation outside of Amari Cooper and David and Joku. We'll see what happens with the running backs there, uh, but still, it's just not ideal uh, for Jerry Judy. It just you know we're hoping for him to get an opportunity to get more targets but he'll once again be the wide receiver two at best uh so let's see what these teams do and uh the next this week coming up will be nfl free agency so a lot more changes to come i'll be checking back in and see if we've got some updates so we can break down and figure out where to go from there so hope to see you on the next one and thanks for watching